YouTube, it's Nikki from Nikki Lily. So today I've got a slightly different video. I've been doing kind of different videos recently and today I've got a video which I am super duper excited about filming and showing you guys. As you can probably tell from the title, I'm doing a review slash first impressions of the new Zoella Beauty Sweet Inspirations range. This was launched on Friday the 27th and I really, really love this range, even from just first impressions and first glance, as soon as I ordered it from Feel Unique, I was so excited, and I was just counting down the minutes and hours for the package to arrive with all of the goodies in it. So I've got all of them except the candy clutch and the body fondant. I think there was a bit of a problem with the body fondant and kind of manufacturing and things like that, so I don't have that or the candy clutch, but I have everything else and I'm so so excited because I love Zoella as a YouTuber she's my all-time favorite youtuber and ever since I was seven she's just been a massive role model for me so I was super excited to maybe try out the products on camera and give you guys my feedback I'm sure I will love them I think just from first glance and what Zoe has brought out um, in this collection it's going to be my favorite collection so far although I do love the tutti frutti one and the original one this just is so up my street because my room is rose gold my room is mint green or kind of duck egg blue and most of the colours in this are my all time favourite so I really can't wait to show you guys everything and I'm so so happy for Zoe that she's brought out another yet again amazing collection so let's jump into everything and I can't wait to try it out for the first time on camera. This is the Zoella Life is Sweet Beauty Bag I love 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 this when I saw Zoe show this on the video where she told us that she brought out a new collection and what everything was I fell head over heels from this and it's so gorgeous it just says life is sweet and then has a little Z and it says Zoella Beauty at the bottom. The thing I love about this is the simplicity of it although it is just a really light blue bag with a scalloped edge and gold writing it's just so cute and it's really nice as a coin purse slash a purse or to put your kind of necessities for a flight or when you're traveling and I'm gonna get so much use out of this because I've needed something that's not too small but not too big for a purse or just for traveling or even for school I'm gonna take this into school when I go back to school because I'm currently on half term and I bet you all my friends are gonna want it it retails at six pounds which I think is an absolute bargain the next thing I've got is the Zoella Beauty Double Cream Body Cream and it says Sweetly Nourishing Macaroon Scented Body Cream. This is the first thing that I can actually smell. I've not smelled anything before so I'm so excited. And it's got 160 mils in it which I think is absolutely amazing because you do get a lot of product in it considering the price. It's got a very cute... Um, style and background on it. It's got kind of like a candy cane-esque vibe to it but the stripes are a really nice kind of creamy white and a dusty light pink and the back says, I'll read you the back, it says treat yourself to a dollop of indulgence with this macaroon scented body cream enriched with nourishing sweet almond oil, cacao and honey. It will leave your skin feeling Beautifully soft, silky and smelling totally irresistible. Gently massage into skin until fully absorbed for a soft fragrance finish. Okay, I'm going to smell it now. I'm so ready for this. I think I've fallen in love. This smells so nice. It reminds me of like when you walk into a bakery or a patisserie, patisserie, which is what kind of Zoe was trying to get this whole range inspired by. So yes, I think this is a super duper well thought out product and also, I don't know if this is just me, but you know when you pop the lid off something that's really nicely fastened down, that kind of click you get? Oh, that's so... It's kind of... It's really strange because it starts off as really kind of marzipan-y and then it kind of goes down and lingers in your senses and goes slightly more musky. It's really lovely though. So I've just taken a little bit of this and I'm going to rub it into my arm. I've got quite flaky skin so this is already 
feeling like it's nourishing my skin a lot. Or it feels, it smells really nice. It smells even nicer on my arm than it did in the um, tube. Oh, it's gorgeous. And I love how it's kind of sinking in really, really quickly and gradually. And it wasn't a pain to rub in. It is definitely a little bit thicker than the candy cream from her Tutti Frutti collection. But I actually really like that it's slightly thicker because it feels like it's kind of doing more and nourishing and moisturising your skin more. I can't get over the scent of this range. I'm going to be using these products all year round because... With the scents in the first range, I didn't feel like they were too special, but I did love the packaging. And then in the second range, I felt like it was more kind of towards summertime and springtime and kind of sunnier seasons and things like that. Whereas with this range, I feel like it's an all year round range and I think this is the kind of most thought out range to do with the packaging and what they are producing to give to people and the scent and things like that. I'm just going to be smelling my arm for the rest of the day. I know that sounds really weird, but oh, I can't get over the scent. I was probably most excited about concept-wise and kind of creativity-wise. It is the bath and shower milk enriched with sweet almond oil, cacao and honey. So it just looks like this. You get 400 mils, which is so, so good. It's kind of like a milk carton-esque thing, but a lot, lot more gorgeous. I wish my milk came in a carton like this. It's so lovely. So yeah, this is really lovely. And the kind of um, instructions for using it are put a small amount of this creamy latte under running water or apply straight to damp skin. Oh, yeah, that's really clever. This smells gorgeous. Although the whole range is gorgeous and it's kind of weird I'm saying this smells gorgeous compared to this. But they do both smell the same. This is slightly, I'd say, lessly strong. Lessly, that's not a word. Less strong. I love that it's kind of a creamy colour. It's not a kind of like usual white shower gel colour which is very very nice and I love and adore and am in love with the packaging. I love the goldy lid, I love the blue and gold packaging with the scallops on it and I can't get over this font. I wish I could write in this font every day and everything that I saw which had writing and words on it was in this font because I'm really falling in love with it. And so this is probably one of my favourite things out of the collection just because it's so creative and I can see myself using this so much on pamper days or when my friends come round or literally just showing it to everyone that comes to my house because of the amazingness and cre creativity that went into this product. Oh, I totally forgot to say this retails at £6 which is also a super great bargain price considering the amount you get and the quality. Moving on to one of Zoe's signature things that she has in every collection or has had in every collection up to this one and it is a Bath Fizza bar. This is called Le Fizz. I am in love, in love with the packaging. I'm in love with this whole collection but the packaging of this is super beautiful. You get 200 grams which is so so good. It's kind of like the Fizz bar which she had in her first collection because what she had fresh Fizz, I think it was called in the second collection, the Tutti Frutti one, and that was kind of like half of this bar. It was a lot thinner and shorter. And so I love that you get a lot in this, and the packaging is just to die for. All of them are kind of geared towards pampering, and pampering is one of my favourite things to do every Sunday, and it's kind of like my pleasure. So I cannot not wait to use this. I'm actually going to open this up so I can smell it. It says, do not eat. I love that. Ah. Do you know what? I can't open it. It's just not cooperating. But again, the packaging is gorgeous. And I'm quickly going to look on my computer to see how much it is. I think it's £5. Yes. This is £5, which is really great it's just such a great price for something this big because if you think in lush you'd get kind of like 
a bath bomb for about three pounds and so just say a bath bomb is kind of like half of this and then so you could get like two bath bombs and that would be around six pounds so this is kind of like one pound less and you probably get your money a little bit more well spent because if you think you use four chunks you'd get a lot more use out of it and so this is a really good one for traveling as well it's not too messy and you but whenever I see Zoe upload a video usually on a Sunday that's the one that I go to even if there have been other like five other YouTubers that have uploaded a video which I do still love Zoe's one is always the one I go to because she's so happy even if I am happy on a happy day she makes me so much more happier and she's probably just one of the inspirations in my life with the positivity she has and you know just kind of her aspirations in life and she She's a lot like me in many ways, you know, the, her video ideas are a lot like mine and on my channel, if you look at some of the comments in my um, YouTube videos, it says you're like a mini Zoella, which I take as a massive compliment because when, because yesterday I tweeted that I had got my stuff in the post from Feel Unique and that's one of the sites that sells Zoe's products besides um, Superdrug and when I tweeted to my people that follow me on Twitter that I was going to do a review slash first impressions of Zoe's products. Zoe actually um, liked it and I was so so happy. It really made my day. That's how much I love Zoe. Like anything to do with her I 100% will support her and buy anything that she brings out because anything that she does I love and I love her so much as an all round person and young woman. This is probably also one of the things which I think look very amazing and it's kind of be one of those signature pieces that are going to be on my dressing table because it's really lovely and kind of 1920s looking which I love. So it's a Sweet Inspirations Fragrance Body Mist. Zoe said that it's quite heavily scented compared to usual body mist which I really like and I love that at the back there's kind of a scalloped packaging that goes through to the front which is really gorgeous and this is probably my most favourite packaged body mist so far because it kind of doesn't just target kind of the younger girls it kind of also targets young like adults as well because the packaging is a lot more mature but in a nice way it's not too mature just spray it on myself you get 45 mils in this and this is eight pounds which is a absolute bargain because you get kind of 45 mils in usual perfumes which are like 30 pounds and are still this type of packaging. It's not too overpowering, it is definitely more heavily scented than a usual body mist which is really kind of light on your skin but it's not too heavily scented. I thought it was going to be quite kind of concentra concentrated with the scent but it's not at all. It's really light and airy version of the scent in this range which is kind of like a sweet marzipan, um, sweet almond, sweet scent but not too sweet, slightly musky scent. I think that was such a bad um, description of this collection scent wise but yeah I really like this and I'm definitely going to be wearing this a lot actually I think I'll wear this a lot in summer and I think also this will be nice in winter as well I've just sprayed some on myself even though I was wearing some rose perfume and this doesn't go with it but still I had to put some on because this is probably going to be my new favorite perfume last product I'm really sad this is the last product I feel like I breezed through everything really quickly although this video will probably be a longer one I just I just wish Zoe had brought up more because I just love this collection so much and this is the sugar dip I love 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 the packaging of this do you know why because it reminds me of something you'd put like some treats in that you'd get at like a patisserie or a unicorn horn which I also love it's not too simple but it's not too over the top that makes a bit more sense so yes I'm going to read you the back and I think this retails for, let me just check how much this retails for. This retails for £6 and you get 200 grams, which is also absolutely amazing. And it says, sweet macaroon scented bath salts. Lie back, relax and indulge in these irresistibly scented bath salts. Melt your troubles away. Sprinkle a small handful of the bath salts under running warm water. Um, the bath salts will slowly dissolve to leave your bath water smelling delicious so it comes with this little lid which has a scalloped bottom and these 
gold lines going down it and then it has a Z in purple in that gorgeous French patisserie font and then Zoella in purple as well I don't know if you can see that and then it just says sugar dip in white so that's really lovely and that's the lid and then at the bottom you get a gorgeous mint green bottom which carries the salts in and then it has the continuous golden lines on it which kind of match up together when you have the lid on top of the bottom and then inside you get the glorious bath salts or shall I say sugar dip so yeah it comes in this really lovely bag just like that and it all actually has a little tear slit in it I don't know if you can see that where you can tear it so I will tear that in a second but something that she actually said in the um, video that she did about the products that really stuck with me is that she put in a receipt Reese, reseal me sticker which I think so well thought out because I can't actually count on my fingers how many times I have opened something really too much and I've had nothing to reseal it so I've had to like wrap it up with cling film or something and I love how there's a little slit in it it just makes everything so much easier and so let me smell it now I don't know about you but I always like with food or anything if it's like in a packet I always like tear it from the middle I never open it like that I just am a bit fuddy duddy and a bit bish bash bosh with things like that I need to be a little bit more careful when opening things like this right I can already tell this is going to be a messy thing but the crystals are really cute actually. They don't remind me of normal crystals. They are kind of like, I don't know if you remember this, but rock candy. You know when you get those rock candy lollies? It reminds me of little pieces of that. I don't know if you can see, but it's just white and looks like that. Oh, my doorbell rang. It's just kind of white. So I'm going to smell this. I'm going to literally use everything tonight and I'll post a picture on Twitter and Instagram for you guys. That's really nice. It's not too strong actually because I thought it'd be a bit stronger. And this scent in this type of form is quite layered. You first get the really kind of powerful marzipani sweet almond sweet scent like macaroon inspired and then it goes to more musky and it kind of lingers in your senses so that's it for this video everyone thank you so much for watching i really hope you enjoyed it if you did let me know and i'll do more review videos of zoe's products and other things in the future because i'd really loved doing this video i think review videos are going to prove silly car i think review videos are probably going to be my new favorite thing to film and yeah, I just want to say again, Zoe, if you are watching this, then thank you so much for being bringing this stuff out. And so many people love you out there, and you've been such an inspiration to me. And this is probably my favourite collection so far. And you've done such a great job with your channel and with bringing out products and your books. And so thank you for all of that, because whenever I'm having a bad day, I always go to you on your main channel or your vlogs or on Alfie's vlogs. And yeah, I just love you and Alfie to pieces. So thank you so much for watching, everyone. Don't forget to like this video if you liked it and subscribe if you are new. That would be absolutely amazing and I'd really appreciate it. I love you all so much to the moon and back. And I shall see you super soon. I will leave all of the links down below to my social medias and also where you can buy Zoe's products and the links to each of these individually. And I will see you soon. Bye everyone. Love you so, so much.